Hey guys, Southside Stacker here, and I'm going to review the 2017 Silver Swan. The Silver Swan is a one ounce silver coin from the Perth Mint. That is the official mint of Australia. So this is a sovereign coin. Before we dive in, I'm going to give you the same disclaimer I gave you for the Silver Krugerrand, which is this is a very nice coin. Um, you should not remove this from its protective um, casing or capsule or plastic, however, however way you received it. That being said, I removed this one from his capsule just to show you what it looks like. So let's dive right in. All right, so on the obverse, we have the effigy of Queen Elizabeth II and lettering that reads Elizabeth II, Australia 2017, $1, the official denomination, one Australian dollar. On the reverse, we have the lettering surrounding the silver swan, which reads the one ounce 9999 Australian silver swan and the effigy of the silver swan in the center. And we have a sharp reeded edge here. Very nice. So let's talk about the features. Uh, we have the we have uh, varying finishes here. So we have the, a mirror finish along the edge, a frosted background behind the effigy, frosted lettering, and a mirror-like polish on the queen. Uh, very detailed here. So let's we'll start with the strands of hair. You can see all the individual strands all the way to the top of her head very beautiful and you're always looking for lines very fine lines when you're looking at a silver purchase you can see the individual jewels in her crown there very nice um, you can see the detail in her face the sculpted detail the lines on her neck her chin her raised cheeks you can even see her pupil in her eyes to the wrinkles in her forehead the wrinkles near her eyes uh, this is very good detail here exactly what you want. You have the mirror finish here. You can see my fingerprint in the reflection. Uh, so this is definitely a very good finish. Frosted background, but it's polished very well. And that frost extends to the lettering. So it's a very good uh, silhouette of the queen when you hold it in the right place. Good profile there, really nice. Same thing applies to the swan, except a lot more detail here. Uh, Let's see, yeah, so we have the feathers here. Detail along the neck, the eyes, the beak. Even the water that it's swimming in. It's really nice. Instead of a landscape, we have a frosted background. Uh, this design is purp uh, purposeful. This is just to make the silver swan the only thing that your eyes go towards. It's perfect. The lettering here is frosted as well, but it's much thinner than the front. I think that, once again, plays into the design of making the Silver Swan the only thing you pay attention to. It's almost as if the lettering isn't even there. Very thin. I just want to flip that again. So this is how thick the lettering is here. Very wide letters. When you flip it around, very thin letters. It could just be the, uh, the fact that there are so many letters. If they were too thick, it would take up too much space. But... Um, I believe this was purposeful. You have the P mark there, telling you it's a uh, Perth Mint. Mirror edge, mirror like finish on the swan. It's very beautiful. This coin is a uh, five out of five all the way. It's the it's a, it's made perfectly. Varying finishes finishes. There's current um, there's a, um, a denomination official denomination to the coin. And there's a lot of history to it. The Perth Mint um, logo is a swan. And this is actually the first year release for a swan um, for the Australian Mint. So this is a very, um, very historic. And the history of the Perth Mint is it was uh, first founded many years ago in uh, 1829 on the shores of the Swan River in the original colony um, in the original colony of uh, Australia in a territory that was called the Swan River Colony. Um, so that's why there's a lot of history behind this. Um, the logo of the Perth Mint is the swan. This is the first year they actually made a swan coin. It's really nice. So yeah, five out of five. Uh, the price of this coin when it first came out, I think mid-year 2017, it was just uh, maybe three to four dollars over the price of silver. Uh, there was only 25,000 of these minted, so it was very limited, and it sold out in two days. 
Um, but then end of the year 2017, I think there must have been a buyback because they're back on sale. But they're at a sale at a much uh, higher price. Now they're between like 112 and 125 depending on who's selling it to you. And I doubt they're going to sell out again. Um, I believe it's the same 25,000 that are out there. But I doubt that anyone's going to buy a coin, a uh, silver coin, one ounce for 112 to 125. That's ridiculous. I think that's the same reason why the silver Krugerrand hasn't sold out is because um, everyone recognizes the ripoff when you see it. So I advise that you don't buy this silver coin if you haven't already. But if you have, um, then good luck or not good luck, but happy luck to you because um, your coin has appreciated in value in less than a year, almost sixfold. So, yeah, that's the silver swan. Thanks for checking it out.